for the Tanners Wine Merchants North of South Shropshire Hunt members, subscribers and farmers race and making their way to the first of their 18 obstacles. Flaminger leads them to it. From Bally Rath on his outer, Dunicos on the inner. And then back behind them comes Little Light, Mr. Snuffles and Trooper Jones, just the back marker as they come to the second. All of them safely up and over that. Flaminger the grey, Mr. Snuffles, uh, sorry, Bally Rath on his outer. They make their way on towards the third. Flaminger and Bally Rath lead from Dunicos and Hazard Colognes. And then Little Light, Mr. Snuffles, and still the back marker, quite keenly held, is Trooper Jones at this point as they begin to make their way towards the next. They come into that one. Bally Rath and Tommy O'Brien just very slightly quicker through the air than Flamager and Dan Cherryman. And then Dunicoff on the inner, as it belongs, Mr. Snuffles, Little Light, and Trooper Jones. So, not much more than four or five lengths at this point separating the field as they make their way down towards what will be the final fence in another complete circuit's time. Coming down towards that one, it's still Bally Rath. Tommy O'Brien with only a very slender advantage and uh, has a clone to Joss Lovegrove Field and with a good jump there came up to take closer order in second challenging manager for that position as they begin to make their way on out to the next that's number seven they're coming towards that one Bally Rath and Flaminger again in the air together. Very close to them was Hazard Colognes, then Mr. Snuffles and Dunicos. Little Light. And still the back markers, Toby McCain Mitchell and Trooper Jones, but an awful long way to travel yet. Go on, they go towards the next. Bally Rath and Flaminger, just Bally Rath. Quicker through the air there. Flaminger very slow. Lost ground to Mr. Snuffles and has a cologne. So going on along the far side, Valley Rat <laughs> by a length, has a cologne and Mr. Snuffles. A good jump by Mr. Snuffles on the inner. Comes up to join Valley Rat, Hugh Edwards and Mr. Snuffles. And they're off has a cologne. So as they make their way on, it's Valley Rat by three quarters of the length now by from Mr. Snuffles. Has a Cologne, Flaminger, Dunicos, a little light in the line behind them, and then some three or four length gap back to Trooper Jones. Still the back marker. Oh, and at the next we've lost Mr. Snuffles. Mr. Snuffles unseating Hugh Edwards at that. The six remaining going on. He's up on his feet, of course, continuing to run on. So continuing on, Bally Rath leads by a length and a half. As it belongs, Flamager comes next. And a little light doing across. And still back marker is Trooper Jones and Toby McCain Mitchell. On towards the next on the far side. Still Bally Rath leads them into it. A half a length clear. Just up go fielding and Hazard Colognes, but made up ground again on landing. Bally Rath from Hazard Colognes back to Little Light and Flaminger and then Dunicos. Still the back marker Trooper Jones. They have a very long run now onto the cross fence. They make their way along the side of the river. A bit of a dog leg before swinging left handed and uh, vanishing out of sight as they go towards the cross fence. They come towards the bend, begin to swing left-handed. Ali Rath has opened up a three-length advantage over Hazard Colognes and Little Light Flaminger. Two lengths clear of Dunicos. And three lengths clear of Trooper Jane. The six remaining runners left-handed. They go towards the cross fence, which the hedge obscures from our view. They'll begin to reappear through the gaps in the hedge and then swing left-handed towards where it began. As they do, still Valley Rath leading from Little Light, Dunicoff, Hazard Colognes. Lamage has lost a lot of ground and been relegated back to fifth position. And Trooper Jones 
still the back marker. So as they make their way to what was the first fence, the circuit ago, there's now Little Light who's jumped up to join Valley Rath. Little Light on the outer of Valley Rath back to Dunicos. And they've opened up a seven or eight next advantage over Trooper Jones as the Colombian manager is now the back marker. First three up and over the next safety. Little Light, Dunicos has now come through to take second from Valley Rath in this third. Those three, not a lot to call between them as they make their way towards the next. Little Light, Dunicos, Valley Rath. And looking back at Trooper Jones, Hazard, Colons and Flaminger. Long way back behind these leading three. Looks as though Dunicos has now gone to the fourth from Valley Rath. Little Light has been relegated to third with three minutes left to take. As they come into the wings of it, Dunicos by just over a length from Valley Rath. He's a length clear of Little Light. So Valley Rath and Dunicos now coming down towards two from home. As they come down to it, Dunicos lands with just a very slender advantage over Valley Rath and Tommy O'Brien. Dunicos on the outer and Iola Hopkinson. Valley Rath with a run coming through on towards the final fence. As they come down towards the final fence, Dunicos on the outer, Valley Rath on the inner. They come down to this one, Dunicos with a slightly better leap at that, going down towards the judge. Dunicos on the outer, Valley Rath on the inner. Very little to fall between those two as they come down to the judge. Dunicos and Valley Rath, that's one for the judge. And looking back, everything else is pulled up. Apart from Trooper Jones, who fell at second last. <laughs> looking back, both horse and jockey up on their feet.